Okay, we've got our 12 volt lighting kit from Hank's Craft. Uh, get all the parts and pieces out here first. Uh, the 12 volt lighting is typically used more in permanent display applications, uh, semi-permanent, uh, but it's also used for temporary uh, when you're running on batteries with a motion sensor that would activate the lights for a brief period of time. Um, so the, the kit is really meant to give you some different options to play with, experiment with, and then everything is labeled so that you can, when you find something that works, you can call us and say, hey, I use this or I use that. Uh, so it's also a good reference tool to have. Um, we, we do include some batteries at the shipment. Uh, 12 volts would be eight batteries. Uh, we've got an eight D cell battery pack. This is commonly used. Uh, this one is also commonly used in, again, semi-permanent uh, and temporary displays. So we get that out so we can go ahead and get some of these hooked up. So we've got a couple different types of LEDs. Uh, if you just want to try them out, you can plug them directly into the battery clip. The connectors are wired such that you can't plug it in backwards. So you can go ahead and start plugging and playing right away um, as soon as you get the kit open. Um, so we've got some different options. We'll kind of work through them here. Um, to start, we've got a few control circuits. Uh, these are motion activated circuits. So you've got your labeled power in for the battery hookup. You've got motion sensor with a label on it that'll activate the lighting and then a labeled plug so you know where to plug the LED into. Uh, so first we'll connect it to the battery power and then we can go ahead and start looking at some of the different LED options. Uh, the motion sensor will activate it for 10 seconds, and we've got a 10 second delay in between activations. Um, so some of the different circuits we've got in here, uh, some will do a fade pattern, some will just do an activation, a straight on activation. Uh, we can customize the different types of patterns. Um, and we'll look at some of the different LEDs. This is what we call an SCLM board. Um, it's used a lot. Originally we used for channel lighting, but it works good for under shelf lighting or just throwing light on a particular product. And then we've got some different types of uh, ribbon LED strips with some different colors. And we can plug a few of these in. And again, the connectors are set up so that you can't plug them in wrong. Uh, this has a uh, standard light spacing with three LEDs approximately every two inches and we can go to a more high intensity type of light. And this would be three LEDs every inch. So there's different colors, um, there's different types of intensities in here. Uh, everything's labeled so that you can let us know what you used, what worked, what didn't. You know, whether you used a motion activated uh, control circuit with the battery clip and then this one actually has a, a fader built into it and I'll show you what that looks like. So we've got a couple different options here. Um, Basically use the kit to experiment. Everything's color coded and labeled. If you want to plug something in to the wall power, there are some jumpers included that will uh, give you a connection between this connector and a barrel jack for the power supply. Uh, so if you just want to hook something in permanently and let it go, that's an option too. Um, if you ever have questions in the kit, we will have contact info in the box. You can feel free to call us anytime. Thank you.